Jody, did you know that the Stanford University study of 8,000 middle, high, and college students indicated a consistent failure in their ability to distinguish news from advertising, identify the source of a tweeted fact, or recognize that a website was created purely for marketing purposes. I did know that. And because of research like that, we are so excited to share information about a new PD opportunity beginning this fall called Information Investigators, teaching civics through information and media literacy. Why would a teacher or teacher librarian want to become an information investigator? Information is the basis for decision making, which leads to action. Our students need the disposition skills and resources to vet media messages so they can exercise their civic agency, make decisions, and take action based on high quality information. As mentioned, there is strong evidence that today's K-12 students have deficiencies in information and media literacy skills. They have difficulty decoding information they receive through their digital devices. Consequently, they are at risk of making poor decisions based on unreliable information. We believe that information and media literacy skills are potentially life-saving and life-changing. We are excited to empower you, our teachers, and teacher librarians with the knowledge, resources, and skills needed to embed information and media literacy instruction into your classrooms so that your students are empowered to become responsible citizens and make informed civic decisions. This PD opportunity will be held once a month for eight months. There will be in-person and asynchronous options. If you participate and complete all eight session requirements, you will earn a $600 stipend and one USBE credit. What should they expect from this PD? <laughs> Good question. Prior to each in-person session, there will be some content that you will need to read, engage with, and or look over. Each in-person session will be one hour and will include opportunities to discuss information that you have read and or viewed. It will also allow for opportunities to discuss, apply, and collaborate with colleagues, PLC teams, and as departments, as well as cross-curricular opportunities. Each month, you will apply the content, skills, and resources that you have read, discussed, and practiced into your classroom. We want this PD to not be just a unit you go over once a year. Our goal is that information you learn in this professional learning will become embedded into your curriculum and your classroom. We know it will look different for your students and your content area, but we know that these skills are essential to our students and our civics future. We know you have a ton on your plate, but we know this PD will be invaluable to you and your students. Please reach out to myself if you have any questions, I'm Jody Ide, the District Social Studies Specialist, or... And I'm Gretchen Zaitsev, the District Library Media Specialist. Contact us through the usual channels if you have any questions. To register, continue to fill out the Google form and follow the embedded link to receive Midas credit. Don't forget to submit the Google form after you fill out the Midas information. Hope to see you all Thursday, October 13th. Bye. Bye. <laughs> okay. Oh, you felt good?